L jeans. Okay, some serious sh going on with the volume. Maybe, maybe bro. people that like cilantro got L jeans. You guys are eating so. They're all inside, and none of them have yellow on. Huh? Yeah. Oh, look at this, Mr. K. What the? Nah, nah, I think I, have, uh... I, I might have to wake back up. My eyes, I can't see anything. No, 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 no. Pedro. It... Come back in. Okay, come back, come out. <laughs> Mr. K, it's okay. It's like a 1940 oh, yeah. film. I'm all fucked up. Everything's in black and white. I think I got to wake back up. It's a 1940 film. It's well, okay. Your eyes that are not perceiving you, Mr. K. You're huh? seeing what you're seeing. What are you talking what about? What happened? Answer me. Uh, whose phone is that? That's my phone. All right. Uh, so, Mr. K and Mr. Vinny, some things have transpired. Uh, as you can see, I have all of the Vagos standing behind me, but two, and that's Diablo and Ceviche. I'm taking what over the south happened? side. Uh, how about what the fuck hasn't happened? Uh, his inability to lead a Southside gang, uh, the 30 minute Twitter beef on uh, Twitter last night, yesterday, that went on for like four to five pages that was embarrassing as hell for the Vagos. Uh, there, there's a whole plethora of things on why this coup is fixing but to Santa, happen. Ain't that something with, uh, with a baby? Yeah, isn't that something that the cats eat when they give birth to yeah. the kitty cats, the little kittens? Yeah, really, it's that cow. I ain't one of those it's, ones, uh, Yeah, Mr. K told me all about it. It's actually very healthy for you. Yeah, very nutritious. Nutritious, that's okay. right. Oh, that's yeah. Uh, so here's the deal. Um, I've, I've taken everybody away from Ceviche. All of his people. He's now powerless. He doesn't have numbers. He doesn't have anything right now. Uh, I am here to ask for a CG support for me to do this coup and take over as Jefe of the Vagos. And oh, uh, whatever business arrangements that you guys had in place will remain in place with the opportunity for new business ventures. I don't see why there would be an issue with that. Vagos business is your guys' business. If there's a fucking a coup de ta, uh, you know, a dethroning, so be it. That's how the streets go. That ain't none of my business. So if I am to successfully overthrow Ceviche and take over as Jefe from the Vagos, I would still, we would still be standings with CG and business would resume uh, with the opportunity for a new business answer ventures. I said of course. Me. I'm not going to take no for an answer. You're going to See, Deep. like I always say, business is business at the end of the day. See, like I said, I'm not going to drown you guys with the well, reasons. What I'm looking at right now seems like you guys have already done it. Uh, I got to Uh, that's the problem. So one of my guys gave $100,000 to Ceviche to put into the gang funds. Ceviche turned around and used that $100,000 to pay V3 to target all of us and take us down. He has v3 another gang, gang per... Yes. They drive around khaki-colored cars and khaki I have, I have, uh, I have numbers. I have one of the two of those people's numbers that are in V3. Okay, that was the group I told you about last night that wanted to get a kickstart. Remember you were like, oh, they're not ready? Ah. Mm hmm So That's this man, Ceviche, has paid a non-Southside gang to protect him and protect the barrio. You think that's where he'll... That's the gang he'll go to if this doesn't work out for him? Mm, I don't think that's the gang he's going to go to, but he's using them to come after us. And they've already uh, hunted us down today and took us out. You know? Are there any uh, other members that are supporting him in this? Because you guys got a lot uh, more members than this, right? No. Um, see, that's the thing. On the roster of the Vagos, there's like 15 members. Only eight to nine of those members are actually active members. I have seven of those eight to nine members. All Ceviche has is Diablo and Lobo. That's it. That's all he has. I've taken everybody else from him. Okay. By a female, fool. I don't know if I should be scared of that. So, uh, so we got V3 now, who I just had a conversation with. Uh, they're willing to take some money from us to uh, flip the script on Ceviche and uh, support us, oh. but I don't trust V3. 
I believe that they'll lust. I, I made an agreement with them. This. If I pay them an exorbitant amount of money to uh, cancel out the contract with Ceviche and they would support us in taking over the Barrio, I don't believe or trust that they'll keep their end of the bargain. And that's the problem that I have right now. Okay. Well, interesting. Um, keep me updated. Let me know how it goes. If uh, things are sorted out and you become the leader, give me a call and we'll continue business as usual. All right, Mr. King. I appreciate you. Thanks for taking this impromptu meeting and everything, Mr. Vinny. I appreciate you setting me some. Yeah, no and, problem. Uh, we'll keep you guys. Uh, we'll keep you guys in the loop. But uh, as of right now, uh, if you guys are expecting to do any business, just know That's that you're only going to be doing huh. business with a gang of only two people. All right. So, if there's anything you need from me or my boys, uh, Vinny has my number. Feel free to call us up. Okay. Sounds good. All right. All right, boys. Have a good one. Appreciate you. See you later. Easy, okay, that guy, that, that ugly motherfucker said he saved you yesterday from the fish place. Yeah, he did. Oh, that was interesting. All right. Yeah. I seen him walk him up here. That's exactly what I was thinking. <laughs> Get the full story. <laughs> yep. I'll give him a shout. Because, uh, you know. We have Something a large amount off. of pistols in our stash that have been just sitting there, and uh, uh -huh. we could move them off to help uh, stir some things up down there. Uh huh. Let me shout out to Ceviche. Drop in my car. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs>